In this video, I'm going to show you an infographic about the three main jobs within data science, data engineer, data analyst, and data scientist, so you can find out if you're doing the right job for you. Hi, my name is Andreas. I'm a data engineer and data science platform architect. And on this channel, I'm helping you build your career and your reputation in data science and especially as a data engineer. So if you're new here, subscribe to the channel do not miss any of the updates. Okay, so when people think about data science, they always think about first the data scientist. It's the same, almost the same name, but there are two more jobs within data science, the data engineer and the data analyst. If you want to know more about data engineering, you can check out this card um, where I talk about the plumbers of data science channel and more about data engineering. Um, then there is there's the data analyst and the data scientist. And I found a real really cool um, infographic about this. Uh, I have the link down below to my um, Pinterest where I pinned this. Um, so it's from 365 Data Science. So what they did, they made a distinction between data and data science, but this is, is not 100%. Um, but you should should look about it uh, in this way. There is the one, uh, one guy who is handling data, who is working on data. And this is uh, why they said, data-driven decisions require well-organized and relevant raw data stored in a digital format. So the, the first job, the data engineer, is more about um, getting the data and storing the data. And then is the uh, another uh, job is business intelligence and um, it's uh, who is uh, working more in uh, with the past so use data to create reports dashboards gain business insight this is the data analyst so what the data analyst does is he is uh, looking at historic data he's trying to figure out a business create business value he is creating uh, metrics kpis um, reports or dashboards for um, the management to make decisions based on um, based on data based on historic data um, like for price optimization or inventory management Th so this is what he does is he, what he's working a lot with uh, like they have here software excel power bi tableau and so on and uh, he's usually working with SQL databases or with uh, with uh, SAP and so on. So this is this is the BI and the data analyst. They said BI analyst, uh, BI consultant, BI developer. This is the the data analyst. After the data has been taken, he is analyzing the data to create business value. This is where where people. Um, are always not sure do we still need data analysts of course we need data analysts um, because the data scientist on the right side the data scientist he is um, more looking into the future he is more about predictive um, methods um, he is more about machine learning and so on so um, so these guys are more into um, advanced analysis, uh, advanced analytics, um, where with uh, with a data analyst you can do, for instance, price optimization or inventory management. It's that's it's a good. Uh, you can also do this with data science, uh, but uh, uh, with the data scientist. But you, can, you see, this is it's confusing for people because you you quickly can uh, mistake those two jobs. Um, yeah, with the with the data scientists, you can do, for instance, you can do more high level predictive stuff like fraud detection, um, sales forecasting, and so on. Okay, so you can see data engineer, data analyst, data scientist. Those are the three main jobs within data science. Um, we all need. We, we need all three. Uh, we need the data engineer who is handling the data, who is making sure data is stored and is, is accessible. We need the, the data analyst to uh, help uh, 
create insight for the management based on historic data, based on KPIs, based on measurements that have been taken and uh, creates reports for them to make this uh, information accessible and and clear. And then we have the data scientist who is more into machine learning, into into the future, into predicting stuff. Okay, so if you like this one, please hit the like button. And if you're not subscribed, subscribe to the channel. And then until tomorrow.